again, uh, this is another one in the series of our particle effects demos from QML2. Um, I'd urge you to go and actually look at the actual code. Uh, all the Qt5 code is available. Uh, this is out of the Qt declarative directory. This is under um, declarative particles, image particles, uh, colored. Um, as you can see, it's performing quite nicely. Again, on the Raspberry Pi hardware, this is an ARM 11 device. We're busy making use of Open, OpenGLS2. Uh, this is as it runs out of the box at 1380 by 768. Um, we should also show you the code right now just so you get a rough idea of how readable QML2 is. Um, so the actual code in question is under... As you can see, this is the code that is required to generate that. Very human readable. It's QML code. It should be familiar to any of those who have looked before. If you've never actually seen QML before, I urge you to go and actually research it further. We blog about it heavily, and it's very easy to actually get working on it using Qt Creator.